I wonder who this could be. We're not expecting any more horses. I know. Wait, let's ask Sophie. She's with it. Hey, Sophie, what are you doing? Oh, well, you know my horse, Spirit? Yeah, he made a run for it, but we finally got him. But I don't think I want to keep him anymore, so I think Emily's going to help me sell him. What? Really? Yeah, he put up a real fight. Wait, so where was he? Well, I believe it was a Cimarron herd that he was with. No clue why he was there, though. Really? He was with the Cimarron? Yeah, I guess, but me and Emily are thinking that he might have been a part of that herd, because he was wild before I got him. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Well, anyways, load him out. Okay. Hi, everyone. Oh, hey, Emily. Well, I'm just going to get him out of the trailer now. Do you have a halter I can use? Yeah, I think we do. Here you go, Emily. Thanks. Come on, boy. Easy does it. Good boy. Are you sure this horse was hard to handle? Yeah, he seems really tame. He looks like it, but he's a real handful. How so? Well, every time you try to lead him, <laughs> he rears. Like this. Watch. Ouch. Oh, I see. Yeah. And that's the whole reason why I wanted to sell him. So that's why I brought him here, because I knew that you would know somebody that would buy him. Yeah, I know a stable that would be happy to have him. What is it called? Silver Glade Equestrian Center. Really? I heard that place was for a bunch of snobs. No, it's not. I think they'd be happy to have Spirit. I mean, they could easily train him. All right, well, let's load him up then. All right, and let me do it, so you don't have to drive all the way there. Okay, thanks, Megan. guys, I'll see you later. All right, bye. Oh, also, uh, Sophie, what is the, um, price for him? I'm hoping to get at least a thousand bucks, or more. All right, I'll be sure to tell them. Hi there, I'm Mimi. Um, are you here dropping off the horse? Hi, yes, I'm Megan, and we are dropping off your horse. Oh great, the girls are so excited. They aren't going to ride him, right? No, of course not. When you talked to me on the phone, he sounded way too wild. Yeah, he really is. And by the way, you have a really nice stable. Thanks. Um, if you wouldn't mind help unloading him, that would be great. Sure, no problem. Alright, there he is. Thanks so much. I'm just going to put him in this pasture behind me and then we can work on the paperwork. Alright, sounds good. I'm just going to park the trailer somewhere and then we can fill out the paperwork. Alright, sounds good. All right, now we can get to the payment. Mimi, can we go see the new horse? Of course, girls. He's in the back pasture. But be careful. He's very wild. Don't worry, we'll be fine. All right, the paperwork's all done. All right, great, and thank you so much for taking him. Sure. All right, I'll see you sometime soon. Yes, definitely. Bye, Megan. Bye, Mimi. Girls, be careful. Girls, come on, we talked about this. I know, but he's just so stunning. Yeah, totally. But who's going to train him? We don't know yet. We're trying to hire a professional trainer because he's supposed to be really difficult. Well, I could train him. Skylar, no. Oh, come on, Mimi. She's one of the best horse riders I know. Chloe, don't you start. Please, Mimi, I have all this extra time since Phoenix just fold, so I don't have to take care of her as much. Or ride, for that matter. 
Yes, but you still have Everest. But, uh, you know, someone else can ride her. <clears throat> uh, Mia? Oh, right, I could ride Everest because, um, Firefly, uh, doesn't need me all the time. Alright, I guess this would work. But you have to train him every day. Sure, I'd be up for that. Okay. Alright, girls, you have a lesson with James right now. Don't be late. Alright. Thanks, Mimi. Sure, girls. Now get to your lesson. Okay, we're going. All right, boy, you just settle into the stable. <laughs> Silly boy. Hi, are you the new horse? Yep. Welcome to Silver Glade. I'm Champion. And I'm Raven. I'm Spirit. Nice to meet you guys. You too. So what brings you to Silver Glade? Well, it's a long story. Wow, you were really a wild horse? Not were. I still am. Well, what are you doing in a paddock then? Didn't you hear the part where I was captured and sold? Sorry. You're fine. But I would like to get to know the horses around here. Sure, let's start with the mare's pasture. Okay. This is Echo and Stardust. Hi there. Uh, hi. Sorry, she's shy. This is Everest. She is the only mare that doesn't have a foal. Hi, nice to meet you. And then that's Phoenix. Nice to meet you. Um, also, this is Ash. Uh, hi. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Uh, Champion, did you hear what happened with Firefly and Jet today? No, what happened? Yeah, Phoenix. What happened? Uh, who's Firefly and Jet? Oh, they're like the meanest horses at Silverglade. Yeah. Totally. So, what do they do? It can't be that bad. Oh, trust us. This is bad. Yeah. Well, anyway, getting back to my story. So, Firefly chewed through all her fancy blankets. I mean, it's like Mia doesn't do anything for her. Really? She did that? Yeah, I mean, come on, champion. It's Firefly. Okay, well, what did Jet do? What do you think? He helped her. Jeez, these guys sound like trouble. Well, yeah, obviously. <laughs> you need to learn the ropes. Spirit, tomorrow I think you'll be able to see the whole place. What do you mean? Spirit, you wouldn't think a beautiful stallion like you wouldn't get ridden? What? I'm getting ridden tomorrow? Come on, boys. He's not going to get ridden. He's just going to be trained. <laughs> Which is worse. Yeah, sorry, that's what I meant. And Spirit, it's not as bad as she says. I mean, maybe for a wild horse, but even then, you'll probably like it. Maybe. Well, who's training me? I haven't had the best experiences with humans. You're fine. You're getting me and Everest's rider. Um, she's really nice. Her name's Skylar, but she hasn't been riding me very much because I just fooled Ash. Oh, alright then. Don't worry, Spirit. She's really nice. Alright, if you say so.